usual guys, what's up? It's your boy for a change and you join us here back at Anne Valley Hospital which is actually an abandoned hospital on the side of an original energy yes, hospital yes. on the other side there. But this place, as you can already probably tell from just the absolute pure decay of what well, was once a thriving, busy hospital for the majority of South Wales along with other major hospitals but this place had actually been abandoned and with the NHS hospital I'm not too sure what the plan is to do here but they are planning to do something with it so we thought that we'd come in get you guys the footage and then show you what's around before it's no longer and okay, hopefully and hopefully find some ghosts watch this hole by you guys watch the hole guys watch the hole would you Guys, I'm sorry to interrupt, but I just want to apologise now for the loudness of me chewing the chewing gum. I didn't realise how loud I was chewing it, and I didn't realise that it was being picked up on the camera. So I just want to apologise for that right now, guys, before we get on to any more of the video. It done my own head in editing this video, listening to myself chewing it, and I regret chewing the chewing gum at the time, but I'm sorry. Um, but I hope you and guys enjoy, and uh, yeah, let's get on to this. I couldn't walk down that corridor. Are you a car? Try and keep out the rooms with the windows in for a minute. I started moving. I'd cry. Dan, oh, shine your light down there. Come stand next to me and shine your light straight down there. What is it? What's in here? Screwing the fact that there's old cops here. Oh, 
another cart. Oh wow, I just got really cold. I'm not going to hold her a minute. So oh, this okay. looks like a, they look like a similar kind of sort of a, maybe a room, I would have hold it, or maybe. I'm guessing kids. Like a resting room, possibly? No, it's definitely some sort of operation room. You think? Definitely. Possibly, 100%. Look at the old lamps, guys. Definitely possibility. The old curtains. I don't like the I wouldn't go down there before. No. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's in here? Yeah, that's what I mean. Guys, you've got to see us, the actual decay of all the paint that's just started peeling straight off the doors and door frames, even the walls. If you look up there, that's the actual plaster coming through, and like, you we'll have to be careful and there, obviously, the roof as well. But that actually looks pretty fresh. Hmm, strange. What we got further in here? Yo, there's a bath, man, check this out. And sinks. Oh wow. So these were obviously toilets. So this would have been the bathing area and obviously the toilet area. It's getting to be a look the bath is still you man. This is absolutely nuts. Right. I'm gonna shut up for a while and uh, just show some mad shots for you guys. So obviously you can see up there, there was obviously something up in the attic as well. Because there's a, oh wait, that, that actually just looks like a boiler. But I wouldn't be surprised if there was maybe storage up in the floor above with the attic. But definitely, possibly. Guys, this whole hallway just gives me the shivers. Just look, you can't even see down there and this torch is bright. Like obviously you can put that into slow motion whatever. This would have been the kitchen. Some of the old um ovens. Very big oven. Oh there's more oh my god. Have you seen this? Yeah. Dan, come and lay on this. It's not a bed there, guys. Oh, wow, I just got a really horrible cold feeling. Gotta get out of there because stuff. We gotta be careful because there is a main hospital right by there, guys. So, uh, we gotta be careful where we do things. Look at that overgrowth. 
I do not want to go in that room. There's more. Right, we'll go together. That's, no, that's um, one of the de devil's hands. Oh, look at the hat. It's a dude. No, you don't. No, I'm not going in yet. No, no. No, no. I used to draw something like that when I was in school. But no, the one yeah. was the one 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 Look at that growth up there. Oh, yeah, I thought that was really cool. Wow. It's like some Chernobyl stuff. What radiation is in there? This place is really cold. Vlogception. Ooh. Are you vlogging me making a vlog? Uh, vlogging me. Sad. It's not sad. It's vlogception. Oh, I don't like this. Shh. These art deco light switches. And again, guys, what I was saying before. I think I touched it. I don't know. I think a bit of pool coming. Did I touch? I touched it. Let it seem cut one. And just like before, guys, I know I said before, but you can genuinely see how old this place is just because of the state of decay of what everything is here. It's just had so much time to degrade over time. I'm kind of guessing. And, that's what we're guessing. Look. The end room. And look at the top of that. Yeah. All the copper coins. That is 100% the end room. Oh, I don't like this. You're in my home now. Lock the end. Shut up. Where's the door shut? Look at that. Oh, it's not even turning up. Jesus Christ. Look at that. What is that? Stop. Is it? Yeah, 
Bring it up. Bring it up to the camera. I will. Right. So I'll, I'll explain what's going on. So guys, what we're going to try and do now, obviously this apparently, according to research, this place is... Apparently because this place is meant to be extremely haunted, apparently with it being a hospital and everything, there's actually more here as well. It was underground down the basement, but it's actually flooded. We look down to the basement and it's up to the top of the steps full of water. It's impossible for us to get down there and show you anything. So um, what we're going to try and do is we're going to light the candle and apparently if you ask a spirit to blow it out, obviously we'll be standing away for you to see it. Obviously there's not going to be any trickery or anything, but we're going to see what happens. So, let's try it. If there's anyone here, can you please make a sign with the candles? Guys, at this point we was getting um, no response off these candles, so we thought we'd walk out of the room and leave my camera on record with the candles and see what happens. Anyone here? Is that a little knock? Please use the electronics if it helps. Try and move that crystal if you're here. Got plenty of battery. <laughs> We're not like the little teenagers who can mess with you. Slightly like twitching. Oh, there we go. Can you see? Wow. We're not here to mess with you, will you? There we go, it's got a bit more. Thank you. What was that noise of? And it's getting cold down here. Sorry, it's out there. That's the car alarm. 
Look, this is an old piano bit. That's a car alarm. Look. Oh, I didn't press anything. Sure. The button's below. This is just a pure place of nightmares. Yo, this looks like it could have been a medicine cabinet place because there's a cabinet on the floor that kind of looks like a medicine cabinet. You can see where the shelves possibly were. Did anyone hear that then? It sounded like a bit of timber being dropped all the way down there, like a plank sound. It went boom. Can you record it? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Is that you? A little bit of footage. Guys, we've just got back from the hospital. It was a very strange um, atmosphere in there. Nothing too spookily happened to us personally, but if you do hear anything or see anything, guys, let us know in the comment section below and I'll check them out, guys. So headphones in and keep your ears open, guys, and your eyes peeled wide open. So I'm gonna edit this video up and it'll be up in a few days. I hope you're liking this little series I've got going on of abandoned places in the night, looking out to see if we can communicate with anyone that isn't human. I must say that I do feel really, really, really strange after this one. My head just feels really zoned out, if that makes sense. I'll keep you guys posted and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.